everyone, I'm Francesca. Welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, we are going to be making these cheesy potato patties and they are so good, so delicious. They're covered in buffalo sauce, they're baked, and they're actually gluten-free. I was on TikTok and this girl I follow, her name's Miriam, made these like deep fried cheesy potato patties and they looked really good. So I had to make my own little twist on them and the eyes are a little bit different, but very delicious and I'm really excited to share the recipe with you all. As always, the full written out recipe is on my blog. There's a link in the description box down below for that. All the ingredients are listed in the description box as well. There is also a link to order my cookbook plentiful if you haven't gotten your copy yet. And if you have, thank you so much. So yeah, there's a link to order this and it is available worldwide. So yeah, these potato patties were so good. My whole family enjoyed them, everybody who isn't vegan as well. And I think you guys are really, really going to like them. So with all that being said, let's get into the video. So we're gonna use three russet potatoes and I'm going to start by peeling them. You can save the skins and you can like bake them and make them crispy or you can put them in a vegetable stock. So once you're done peeling them, I'm just going to chop them up into little quarters. The smaller they are, the quicker they will boil. So, you know, just keep them about the same size so they all boil evenly. Then you're gonna pop them right into a nice pot and top them with water. Yes, I spilt my water everywhere. What else is new? And boil these for about 20 minutes or until fork tender. While they're boiling, I'm going to chop up some scallions. So I'm first chopping them into little slices and then I'm just gonna kind of run my knife through them again to chop them up even a bit more. And then I'm also going to prepare my vegan egg replacement I like the one from Bob's Red Mill. So I'm just going to take two tablespoons of the vegan egg replacer, mix it with some water and set it aside. It'll thicken up a lot. And you can use any vegan egg replacer you like. You can use a flax or chia egg too. So our potatoes are all done. They're nice and soft. So to that, we're going to add our vegan egg to start. As you can see, it really thickened up a lot. Then we're gonna add in some vegan butter, our scallions and some buffalo sauce. I like the one from Frank's Red Hot or Sweet Baby Ray's and a little bit of salt and pepper. And then you're just going to mash them up really, really nice and smooth. You want them to be as mashed up and as smooth as possible. So once it looks like this, you're actually going to give it a taste and then you can adjust and add more salt as necessary. Do keep in mind they're going to have buffalo sauce and the vegan cheese in there. So once I have it all mixed up, then we're going to add in our chickpea flour. I'm using chickpea flour for this. It works really well here. The reason I'm telling you to taste it before you add the chickpea flour in is because the chickpea flour has kind of an earthy taste to it and can make the dough taste weird. So taste it beforehand, then add your chickpea flour in. So just mix that up until it forms a really nice dough. It should be very manageable and you should kind of like see it kind of all forming together. It was kind of moving in one giant mass. <laughs> as you can see here. So just like a nice big dough. And I test it out just by taking it and I roll a little bowl and if it sticks to itself, great. So I made 10 potato patties. So I portioned the dough out into 10 equal amounts. And then I'm just going to use my hands to flatten it out and kind of make like a circle in the middle, like a little well, so we could stuff our vegan cheese in there. And then I'm using vegan mozzarella, but you can use any one you like. I'm using one from Via Life. Wrap it up into a ball and then flatten it into the patty so the cheese is nice in the middle. Pop it on a baking sheet. Mine was non-stick, but if you're not using non-stick, line it with parchment paper. I sprayed a little bit of coconut oil spray on top, and then I'm going to add my buffalo sauce. What you do to one side, you do to the other, so make sure to flip them and get both sides. And then we're going to pop them in the oven at 450 Fahrenheit for 20 minutes and you're gonna flip them in the remaining two minutes. They're gonna get really nice and crispy. Look how good they look. And we have to do a pull apart test. Let's see, let's see, did I do it? Is it nice and cheesy? I think it is. Oh, look at that. Oh my goodness, looks so good. So, so yummy. And now we can just enjoy them. So I stacked a few up on a plate. I kind of treated them like little pancakes, I guess. And I added some green onion on top and a drizzle of buffalo sauce. So these were absolutely delicious. You could dip them in some vegan ranch and I think you are really going to like them. All right, everyone, and those are our delicious buffalo cheesy potato patties. Oh, they're so good. I can't wait to make them again soon. Of course, they're all gone. I made them like two days ago and they're already gone already. But like I said earlier, full written out recipe is on my blog. Link in the description box down below for that. 
If you like my videos, you already know, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Helps the channel out, helps us to grow and spread more vegan recipes. Thank you all so much for watching. If you try these out, leave a comment down below or tag me on Instagram and use hashtag plantfullybased so I can see your beautiful recreations and I'll see you next week with another video. Bye. Thank you.